Hey guys, okay, we're going to do a, a brief tutorial video on how to achieve this yoga crow position. And today I'm going to practice against the refrigerator wall. Uh, a couple things, you're going to want to make sure your wrists are warmed up nice and well, like you've done some down dogs, maybe a, a chaturanga or two. So I just warmed up my wrist just a little bit. And the other thing about it is, when you reach the balance point, you're also going to want to like from your pelvic region, pull your, your abdominal muscles up and in, and then kind of lift the legs as well. So you can be, uh, the reason I said is to keep as a safety backstop, training wheels, if you will. So you don't have to worry about rolling over and maybe injuring your head or your neck. And uh, also the balance point is actually very close to where you lift off. So if I was, I'll face you initially, come into, they call this, I think, goddess or frog pose. And then I'm gonna have my knee get as high up above the elbow as I can get it. I don't know if I burn off some more of this Corona 20, I'll uh, maybe have less to get around. And then you gently start leaning forward. And like I said, the balance point is not a whole lot further than that. I'm gonna use this refrigerator as a training aid. And then lift one foot and then the other. Get back up just slightly here. You start to feel it just before you go. There. And for a moment there, I actually was not leaning into it. And you kind of feel that sweet spot. And my wrists are feeling it. It's a lot of pressure. So you want to warm up first. Kind of relax. And don't try too hard. It's a gentle spot. And when you find it, then you can practice to maybe build up a little bit more. You know, being able to stay in a position a little bit longer. And breathe deeply. Be well, stay well, all the best to you all.